What why what drives you to paint? I mean, what mm -hmm. is, is it the thrill? Is it is it the learning? Yeah. Is it? Um... Well, I'd like to be able to create something memorable one day, mm -hmm. really good. But for me, it's the joy and meditation and the process that I would do it anyway because I love it. Right. Yeah. It, make, it makes you feel good and yeah. that you did it's, something. Like yeah, it's this. part of you, and it's just a, like I said, it's um, it's meditative. You know, it's relaxing. It's focusing. It just fires different parts of your brain. It, you know, it's. <laughs> nothing wrong with painting. And I love all types of painting, um, but I just happen to like plein air best right now. Yeah. yeah. Um, what, what kind of oils do you use? Oh, let's see. I send away for these huge, <laughs> and they put, we put them in caulking guns when we're at home. Oh, you you pre-make them? Hmm? You, you, you make your own oils? No, they're oils. made, but you oh. have, you, I use large amounts at home with larger paintings. Oh, so what was the name of that paint? Classics. Classic. Yeah, classic oils. Yeah, okay. I prefer them. But uh, Grumbucker is good too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you buy a quality art or somewhere? Oh, some things. I like to send away for the good paint. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And canvas or canvases? Or... Well, linen is my favorite. Why? Because the texture comes through. Unless you're going to really slab on a lot of the... Um, the, the paint and make it very textural and it doesn't seem to matter. I like to do it on board, but if you're doing something finely, uh, linen is, has such a quality of leaving the strokes and that linen, I don't know. It, it feels just, different, right? It Wait. feels different and looks different, I think. Yeah. Okay. And especially with portraits. You know. Oh, you do portraits? Yeah, I, there's some on my memory stick there for you. <laughs> I'll flash it on the screen. Yeah. <laughs> um, do you do custom stuff? I mean, someone comes up to you and yeah. says, hey, I would love you to come to a certain area. Can you draw something for or paint something for me? Yes, do you do yes. That? And we've even done things from photographs, but I prefer to be there. If not then, at least have been there. Yeah, so you get the true yeah. color. Because yeah. photographs don't get the, all the colors. No, they're and... very uh, limited in the, in the tone and the color they use. Uh -huh. That's kind of one good thing about painting. You can... You know, change things, make a better design. You know, put a tree there that wasn't because it fits. You know, right? Design wise, yeah. or you know, design wise. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, do you have any um, people you look up to, artists? Well, our one of our directors is uh, Robert Moore, and he's a fantastic oil painter, yeah. and so generous and kind, and, and has always good information to share. Um, I painted with, uh, I like Ivanas Barbarian's work, but I don't paint like Ivanas. Right. And, I, and when you see his work, his color is wonderful, but uh, I'm a texture person, so I like a different style. You know, but everyone has some, something to offer to teach. So, oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I think other than that... Yeah. Oh, and Professor Kilmaster, BSU, retired. Um, he's also been very helpful to the group, our group and uh, is so generous with his um, critiques and... Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, so, um, he's gone now, right? I mean, he's not working at BSU anymore. He's not anymore. working. Yeah. yeah. He's still painting limitedly, but he's painting. Oh, okay. Yeah. We get to bug him <laughs> once in a while, tell him to come paint with us. <laughs> Do you ever go on the, the, the First Thursday walks? Yeah. Yeah, we've had work uh, on First Thursday. Oh, okay. I was yeah. just curious. Yeah. It's fun. It's fun to see everything that's happening. Yeah. 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 I, I did a couple of videos. With oh, the first good. Thursdays. Yeah. <laughs> just yeah. to show people because even the artists don't even know about the first Thursday. I mean, out of town. Yeah. Yeah, true. Yeah. And the events, it's always, you know, something you try. You strive to make the, the word get out. Seven years at the Botanical Garden, seven years at Redfish, and it seems like just the last three people have noticed. Yeah, so, so it's not overnight. It takes oh, time because no, people have to see you over and over and over again until you start yeah. seeing, oh, yeah, there's mm -hmm. the artist that I like. Yeah, and that's what the web does so well. Yeah. Not just ads in the paper. Yeah, yeah. oh, you, have you done ads in the paper? We've done ads for, um, well, Redfish was just one. Uh -huh. And then uh, Botanical Gardens on their website. It should be linked to the, what is it, the event center, the Boise, what is it? Where they have people coming into town. Uh, oh. I can't hear it right now. Yeah. 
Well, one example, there's a, there's a women's group, uh, Welcome to Boise, and um, they had an event, and the husbands were all at this workshop or something, you know, and the wives wanted something new and different to do, so Welcome to Boise women put together an event where they came, and they got to paint for the first time. We were all standing by to help them mix paint so that they get the right color and no mud, and then a, someone was illustrating as they went, they had a little photo too, and they came out with a pretty decent painting, and it was exciting for them. You get a new artist from it. Oh, yeah, that we do get. <laughs> yeah, we, we seem to always grow an artist for every event, which is great. That's good. Yeah, and That's more good. people to pitch in as well, because it needs that. Everybody's vision, um, if they just share their skills, they'll get some goals achieved. Yeah. 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 Have you advertised in any magazines? You know, like those art magazines? I believe there was something in Northwest. No, I wish there was a Northwest magazine. Southwest, uh, when about nine years ago, when the few founders, uh, we, I was the first officer, but the few founders had gotten together and they went down a canyon, down the, uh, a boating trip, and they did some painting. And that was uh, something was in the in a news in a magazine. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, that's cool. But yeah, and it takes money, so that's yeah. why an organization helps too. You know, yeah. you can have an event covered. We had a nice film done by uh, what's that? What uh, what a great state? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. He came up to Redfish. Uh, uh, Channel two. Yeah. 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 He did a nice little piece there and yeah. played it, and it was great. Yeah, he, he did yeah. an interview of me a yeah, couple see, years ago. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Uh, thank you for watching the video. I hope you've um, found something helpful and uh, useful when you're considering your art. Um, you're actually making an investment, and art usually increases in value. So I, I really feel that having an original piece is the way to go. And I think you get years of enjoyment of it. Just buy what you like. All right. Thank All right. you very much.